Okay, we are recording then. It, um, it, it's so weird that it's just the two of us, you know? We've had, the past couple times, we've had one or two other people with us. Yeah, I know, right? So, if you if, if you hear this, like, obnoxious, like, background noise, it's the... Um, AC unit right there. AC unit. Our window unit. Yeah. So, if it's, it's, if it's too obnoxious, I apologize, but uh, there's nothing I can do about that. I can turn it to economy mode and hopefully it'll shut off in a minute. It's just on constant. Like, you know, your, your, your pocket, your back right pocket's been sticking up all the time, right? <laughs> yes, it has. Back, back right. Yeah. I, I've been tempted just, to just stick it in for you. I just haven't bothered with it yet. I'm sorry. Well, I'm, I've been sneezing for the past, like, hour, so... Um, yeah. Well, anyway. Introduce yourself. I'm Gail. No. Let me try that again without the phlegm. <laughs> I'm Gail. I'm Wizard. And this is the trailer we have now. Woo! We actually live right by uh, TJ Coyote and uh, Aurora. And, uh, like, literally they're right down the road. I can see their house from from the window. Yeah. Um, and I need to go give them that fun stuff. So we need to go get some JJ's. Yes, yes, we do. Anyway, um, the new place is all around us. It, it's just a small trailer, but it, it's not bad. It's our first place, so yeah. First official place, but we're on our own. You know, whatever. Um, it's nicer than the dorm. I have my own like kitchen area and stuff. We've been cooking. It comes with washer and dryer, and the it, the fridge is brand new, and so is the washing machine. Yeah, the stove's not that that not that old either. Yeah, it, they had just refurbished it, so yeah, this That's thing is. Cool. It's still a work in progress, actually. We moved in before they actually finished. finished. <laughs> yeah. So they're still working on it with us here. Hey, hey, look, it's a cheap place to live while we're here. Um, so we save a good bit of money compared to living other places that students usually live. Yeah, it's true. I mean, and we live near friends. If I, cut, if I cut up the dorm, uh, dorm fee, into what? How many months is it for spring and fall? Uh, well, so, so, so I guess four months. I think we have been calculating it at six, but technically it's four, I guess. Well, twelve months. So. Yeah, but I'm not counting. Yeah, I'm not, four, not counting summer. Yeah, so that's about four or five. Well, classes start in August, so five. I guess. It So even then, like, it comes out to almost five hundred dollars a month. This place is three hundred and twenty-five dollars a month, and we're splitting it in two. Yeah, and it's you know it doesn't have internet, it doesn't have not yet. Have to, <laughs> not yet. We're working on it. Um, so that's why we've been slow to reply if anybody's interested. Yeah, and why y'all haven't heard anything from me <laughs> except for when I'm at work. And yesterday we went up to campus, but you know, yeah, um, we're working on trying to get him a phone that doesn't suck. Um, and we're working on getting internet so that we can communicate. Metrocast reply! Please Metrocast reply to us. I mean, I've, I've done the registration thing online twice now, so hopefully they will call me. Yeah, we've been actually having some pretty good food. Gail here is pretty decent cook. I try. Um, what was the first? First night was uh, pizza pasta. Yeah. And then various uh, others. Uh, we had red beans and rice. Red beans night. and rice. We did stir fry. Last chicken, chicken stir fry. Last night we just had sloppy joes. Yeah. So good. Tonight I don't know what we're gonna have. Oh yeah, 
Tetrasini. Yeah, we're gonna do Chica Tetrasini. Nice. Um, we've been watching Code Vyoko just because he had been proposing that us and our group should cosplay as Code Vyoko at some Comic Con or something. Yeah. If we ever went to one. Speaking of cons, we should, uh, we're, we are hoping we can save up enough money to possibly go to uh, an FM this, this year. Um, Mythic. Or Mythic. It, whatever it is, it's it's actually not it's Memphis weird. because it's an olive branch, Mississippi. Mississippi, woo! Mississippi has its own fur con. Who would have thought? Yeah. <laughs> Out of all the states that shouldn't have a fur con, Mississippi is one of them. <laughs> we need one, but but we need more furs. We need more furs. The thing is, though, this is Mississippi. It would have thought Mississippi plus Furcon. Yeah, you don't you don't think furries when you think Mississippi. Anyway, um, as uh, some of you may know, I'm trying to get started on a first. We've just ordered a couple of supplies that will come in sometime next week. Yeah. I'm just buying parts as I can afford it, so it's not like it's getting a bunch of money devoted to it at all. I'm just trying to get money on the side for it. I am trying to pay for school because I have like four hundred dollars short this semester. People buy his photos; they're really good. Yeah, I'm doing a photography print sale. I do a lot of nature, wildlife, scenic photos. Um, I've got photos from all over the country and uh, some really pretty wildlife photos. I'm offering them as small as four by six and as big as eight by ten. And I've got three photo collages up on FA, Sofari, and Facebook. Um, and uh, yeah, and I'm offering frames, etc. Depending on you know, it's gonna cost extra to have frames because I can't afford to buy them for you um, unless you pay me for them. And those prices, you know, I I actually went up the price of a lot of this stuff. So. It's, it's good photo paper too. I've got I've got still got some, and I'm gonna buy more if I need it. Um, help a furry go to school. <laughs> seriously, help me go to school so that I don't have to rely on other means of money. Um, because I hate doing that, and uh, I want to pay for as much of it on my own as I possibly can before resorting to other other means. Um, I will not be going out and being prostitute. I'm sorry. Yeah, I get them all for myself. Yes. No one else gets them. <laughs> um, anyway, yeah, so check out those. They're pretty awesome, um, I think. And if you can think of anything that you may want, I might have it back in storage. Um, those are the ones that I'm rapidly selling because I think those are my favorites. I believe are the best photos that I've taken. And I went through something like 20,000 pictures to pick out the ones that I picked for those collages. So it took me a lot of time, it took me a lot of effort, and a lot of grief getting these things. And I have to scale them and edit them to print them at the right size. So you're, yeah, I put work and effort into this. Too bad we couldn't have asked him for questions for this. This this was kind of unplanned. Yeah. And it's and again, it's not like I could look up the list on my laptop anyway, because we don't have the internet in here. Well, I mean, um, I can do it on there. Yeah, you can kind of love it. Um, my phone's on Fritz. I would offer to show you all around, but our house is still in the process of putting everything away. Yeah. <laughs> We've got more stuff than we have space for at the moment, I think. Pretty much. Um, it's getting there. Look at my futon. Do you like my futon? It's a pretty futon. Oh yeah, his pants are freaking awesome. Yes, it's awesome. They give us the futon. There's the a table. table right behind the camera. Um, we've got our dinner table right there, chairs that they gave us. They gave us like a bunch of my stuff uh, that I had at home. Uh, 
I don't know, they sent us even with this blast chessboard. It's really, really cool looking. Yeah, and they also gave me this like electric can opener slash knife <laughs> sharpener it's thing. Fancy. It's fancy. We didn't even have that thing at home. And that was uh that's that's something they, they actually bought for me, like and they bought the table. Um, originally they had table that they were gonna get for us from a friend, but evidently that fell through or something. I don't know. Anyway, they bought this table and chairs. It's really nice. Um what else? What else do we have in here that's nice? We can't have nice things. Well, I, I've got the bass guitar mic from your dad. Does that count? Yeah. Just cause. I'm buying it from his dad just because yes. I've been wanting the bass guitar. And sure. my dad doesn't play anymore, so. Having fun. Anyway, uh, plans for the summer. Well, tomorrow I start the summer field program for the College of Force Resources. Um, yeah, that's going to be hell. Yeah. God, I hope I survive. Well, you did great. I didn't quite get the grades also one last semester, so I'm having to take a course this semester and get an A in it to keep my scholarships. So hopefully that'll go well. Aside from that, I've just got my usual work. It's easy, uh, make it decent money, above minimum wage, and it's my first job, and I don't probably do anything. It's good money compared to how much work you do. Um, as for the class I'm taking, it's going to be in C programming, so I've already started to go through it to start learning it. I'm picking it up pretty quickly, so something tells me the class will be really easy. It's a 1,000 level course anyway, so it's intended for freshmen. Yeah. So it will be easy. Hopefully, yeah. hopefully you don't get one of those teachers. One of those. Teachers. It's probably gonna be one of those teachers that believes everybody in their summer in their summer class failed the first time, so that they're gonna nail that hard. Anyway, so uh, hopefully it's not one of those professors. <laughs> We're one of the professors that's like being punished by the university so they have to work during the summer. Oh gosh. Well. If you ever, um, like, don't speed on the weekends, or no, 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 don't, uh, go on speed on the weekends, because, uh, the cops that are working on the weekends are being punished by the, uh, uh by the ones that have, like, the lowest ticket rate or anything like that. I don't remember that. And the ones that are working the DMV on the weekends, the when you go get your driving test, the ones that are giving you the driving test, those ones are being punished. If, you're, if you get that on the weekend, you can do that on the weekend, those cops are being punished and they will fail you in a heartbeat. Do it on the weekday. I'll keep it. Not that, not that I need to take another driver's test, I've got the license. But, but yeah, it. yeah. Well, I mean, not that it's that. I'll take that back. There's some bad drivers in Mississippi. Mississippi's driving test right now, in Jackson anyway, is go to your car. Pull out, drive around the mall once, park. Yeah, I was expecting them to make me like parallel park, yeah, move through cones. Yeah, I did have uh, any fancy stuff on mine, but go on the road. The road, an actual road with like traffic and stoplights and yeah, I mean I went on an actual road, but it's still pretty easy to hold. The biggest thing on it was that in the parking lot there was a one-way sign, so you had to go left around the building. You could not turn right to exit, but you know, I already tried. Right. Exit. First of all, if you're in a parking lot, those signs don't mean shit. So I pretty they will fail you if you don't make it. Yeah, they will, but in real life, you like a cop can't pull me over for disobeying a traffic sign in the parking lot. It's it's they don't have jurisdiction. Right. So I can go the wrong way in the parking lot all the hell I want, if I, if I so desire. Do they have jurisdiction in the DMV parking lot, though? The DMV is in the mall, so no. No, this DMV is just, it, that's all it is. It's that building, and that's all it is. Only state troopers would. It's a state, it, it's, it's state property. It goes to South Carolina. Only state troopers would. Uh, but, yeah, so that's my plan for summer. My plan 
the summer is hopefully make enough money to pay for the school I'm going to so that I don't have to take a semester off. And then keep good grades so I don't fail and I can keep my scholarship one more semester. Because if I can keep my, uh, my MN Scholar grant, that'd be nice. Because I've got a 3.6 right now and I have to keep 3.5. So as long as I keep I'm sure you'll do well on that. Uh, it seems like this summer is going to be fairly, well, I want to say unbusy, yet it's, what we will be doing will be taking up a lot of time, especially with your summer camp stuff. Yeah. Mark for me is just 8 to 5 with a lunch hour in between. Whatever. Mine is eight to whenever. Yeah, whenever I get. Uh, that. <laughs> unfortunately, I could not find a good online class to take. So unfortunately, the class I'm taking will be in the middle of the day. It's two hours every day, so one of those hours I'll spend on lunch break, and the other I just, you know, will be out of work, out of work. I'll eat lunch during work, which I'm able to do, so I'll be working seven hours a day instead of eight hours a day, making a little bit less money, but still decent. Yeah. In the afternoons, I'll probably do it, I've been doing usually, ended with the addition of homework. So I'll be doing art, music, whatever, watching Go Video Go if we haven't finished it up, I think we'll check out. Now later I'll be cooking. Most of the time, I shouldn't be up too late. The rules to record some crap. Um, I think. Well, it's MFM plans. Uh, we'll, we'll, we're checking with you closer to time when if we decide to go to MFM. Uh, let's see. I think I don't know for sure if he'll be doing it, but one of my friends from Hattiesburg will hopefully. Suiting here, so we'll get to hang out with him maybe. Yeah, when he comes up, make sure it's a weekend. Oh, yeah, I already told him it's a weekend. Because if it's a weekend, I go. Yeah, I, want, I don't want to be home. Because I don't, I mean, I've never actually, I don't really hang out with too many friends on the campus. So. Yeah, I and mean, during the summer, we've got like nobody, it's just us, and then we need to go down and visit to a good hamburger. Yeah, well, I'm sure I'll hang out with Amber while you and TJ are away in summer camp. Yeah. Um, what else? What else? What else? There's not really anything new aside from the new place right now. Yeah. I'm kind of relieved that classes are over from last semester. It's a lot more laid back at the moment. Yeah, I've uh, I've not been doing too much other than well, everything. Too much of that. Too much other than everything. I've been attempting to put stuff away, attempting to get things organized, try to figure out where things go, cook, clean, deal with the landlord, deal with the internet. No, but she, I don't know if you noticed, but they fixed the giant hole in the um, side of the house. The house yeah, side. yeah, the outside. Okay, so that was what they were doing? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I haven't been outside, so... And they fixed the doorknob on the bathroom. Yes, they did. Um, there's various stuff that needs to be finished, but nothing too major. As soon as we get the dryer in and we get the washer hooked up, Said. Oh yeah, she said she was going to ask about the hookups in the washroom. She said the dryer should come in Tuesday. Awesome. Because you see, as it turns out, most hoses to connect washers are three, 
fourths inch, but the but the connector on the wall has a tag on it that says half inch. I don't know what the size on the back of the washer is, but I'm not sure if they're the same size or not. They have a connector. It's half inch too, with a certain with a uh, something connector. I forget what it is. It says on there. Anyway, um, I'll take a picture of it when I when we go back to Lowe's or whatever. If you have to, right. if not, the landlord will bring it in and fix it. But yeah, I hope so. Because they've been really nice to us. Oh yeah, they've been really nice. Um, helping us out, getting stuff ready. Um, yeah. We've got to get the water transferred over our name. I don't think we need the registration for that. Okay. One thing I appreciate is that she let us just put him on the paperwork instead of both of us, so he's able to get more money from both rehab due to that. Yeah. And that's the great assistance. That allows me to focus my money on the bills of food while he pays for it. That'll help. Um, and then I'll be able to pay this month and next month's rent. Awesome, awesome. Uh, let's see. Did we already pay this month's rent? Yeah, we already paid this month. Yeah, like I said, this month's next month's rent. Next month, well, next month and the next. Right, right. Whenever we get our power. So June, July. August, I'm not sure, because. We gotta figure out what to do with August because school starts in August, but but we have kept severely slow about getting me money. So hopefully I should have that extra money, so I mean if they are late like I should have enough money to go for us until we get paid back. Yeah. The hopefully they said that they said that they could pay me for me, so Okay. For the outing. Which will be better. Yeah. And then, if all works out as planned, I should end up with more money in my pocket each semester than I have the past couple of semesters. Because food should be cheaper for us since we're buying and making our own food, which is generally cheaper than eating out anyway. And if I'm right, the meal plans are probably overpriced for what we get. Well, for what we were eating, <laughs> for the amount of food we were eating, four meals a day. And well, well, okay. Yeah. For how much we are eating now. Yeah. Comparatively, because we we took advantage of the unlimited block meals. We really did. <laughs> of course, when you're when you're paying a lot of money for that kind of stuff, you better take advantage of it. Yeah. Um. It, yeah. Your money is So I won't have. I will be losing the MESG because of my GPA, unfortunately. Um, aside from that, though, we won't be paying for dorming, for the dorm housing. This is much cheaper, so that's a little bit more extra money to have. I won't be having a meal plan. Instead, we'll just be doing food here. We might have a small meal plan so we can eat lunch on campus. But aside from that, that's when that will be much cheaper. And I can just put money on my on our uh, cards, too. We can, you can actually do that. You can put money directly on your student ID. Yeah. And you don't have to get a meal plan. You can just the thing is that the, the, the um, to eat at Perry is like nine something for yeah. lunch. So if you get a yeah, but commuter meal plan, it's cheaper. It should be cheaper. Yeah. If you eat at Perry. Because yeah. I was figuring that's what we would do for lunch. Because you can eat it um, Well, if not, we can do so good at that. I probably won't be eating too much lunch next semester. I don't know. With my labs being the way they are, lunch is sort of going to be out of the question. I don't know why they set up my schedule like this, but like everybody's schedule this semester is crazy because of the lab. And they set up the, uh, the schedule so that during your junior year, your first semester, you have four labs. And they all run from like 11 o'clock like four and so your entire afternoon is taken up by these labs and you don't have time for lunch and they just don't think these are and they're non-credit producing labs which really sucks i've got my schedule pretty easy 
this coming semester. I've only got 14 hours of classes, which I intended to get more, but whatever. Um, and I finally got all my classes are the labs in the morning. Labs are in the afternoons. So that gets out of the way, which is also really good for if we do go to MFN, because we'll have to leave early on Friday, since all my classes are in the morning. Um, either I'll only miss one class, or I won't miss any, depending on when we leave. Yeah, that's good too. My classes are in the morning on Fridays. So. Of course, that usually people stand earlier, you know. Yeah, and sometimes right before a, uh, a holiday, though, some of the professors will be like, uh, <laughs> yeah. Because they know you're not going to pay attention. You know half the class is not going to be there anyway. Yeah. And that's Labor Day week. So. Yeah. So. And then that means we'll be able to stay the whole time on Sunday instead of coming back early. That and it's not that far from here. It's a couple of hour drive. Yeah, it's like, what, two and a half hours? Which is nice because FWA sucked gas, so much gas. With only two people paying gas, it was like something ridiculous, like seventy-two dollars a person. That's better than some people would get. Yeah, because um, we've got our vehicles have decent gas mileage, and we both went gas cars. So getting we got a private. We got we got just shy of thirty miles per gallon uh, up there, and on the way down we got. We got about 30 because it was down now. And so, actually, going to MFM, I mean, it's still a maybe, but if we do decide to, it still won't cost that much. $45 for pre reg, and then it's $105 per night in the hotel room. We were planning on bringing two, nights, yeah. two or three nights. If we put four people in here, that means each person's only paying, you know, just over $50 for the hotel. And then there's gas, which will be cheap. Yeah, because I'm only going to need a tank of gas, a tank and a half at most. Right. So that means each person will only have to pay a little bit over $100 to attend. You know, 100 to 150 um, And so that'll allow us either to be able to go if we wouldn't have been able to go otherwise, or we'll be able to go with a little bit extra spending. Depending. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it should be easy to get Yeah, I'm gonna attempt, like I said, I'm trying to save, I'm trying to pay for school, and once I do that, anything else will go towards spending. Anything else will go towards Bias giving photos. Seriously. They're really good. Seriously, I know, I wish my art was good enough to do a pose or an auction or something. <laughs> I can put one up, I'll see about doing it next weekend. Um, but I'll see what I can come up with. Yeah, right now my auctions and stuff. The reason I did an auction last time is because no one commissions me. People, you mean commission me, please. Um, but aside from that, the money I'm earning from the auctions and commissions I'm trying to put to the pursuit. Um, most of my money right now is going to bills and food. And then, of course, we'll be going to school. Right now, I've only gotten about just over 200 for the past two paychecks. I get paid every two weeks. But that's because these paychecks were from when I was still working during the school year. My next paycheck and every paycheck after that will be paychecks from working during the summer. And I'll be making over $500 each paycheck. That'll allow me to easily raise the money to pay for my school week, which I think should be about 700 for during the summer. Because it's a three hour course, isn't it? $200 per hour? Or not 200 not 240 something. It's, yeah. Oh, 240 Yeah, okay. 242 I think. Forever. Well, then it'll be closer to 800 700 but still. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, there's that. And then, after I pay for that, any money I have over. We'll go to MFM and various other things. Um, any other necessities? Uh, ah, any other necessities first, and then MFM. Yeah. So, yeah. Hopefully that'll work out all well. People buy his photos. Because I'm like seriously like four hundred dollars short. Trying to. Yeah. Well, 
Yeah. Uh, hopefully this will work out well, but any help is appreciated. And I, I mean, I don't mean help as in donations, though I won't turn away donations. I prefer you commission me, though. I'd rather earn the money. Yeah. And I, like I said, I'll do these print sales. Um, I've got prints. I've got really nice pictures. I've got, I've got pictures of alligators. Anything from alligators to chipmunks to elk to elk. And I've got mountains, flowers. Go take a look at this little sand thing. Um, um, yeah, I've been around and I've done a lot of things and I've took a lot of pictures. So, uh, been there, done that, got the picture. Yeah, pretty much. Um, and I will print the picture and I will send it to you. Um, just and then a you pay a little bit extra for it. Yeah. Um, get something pretty to hang on your wall. Give yeah. to your mom. Give to your parents. Give to your cousin. Give to Father's your... Day is not too far away. They, they, they could Day. make good gifts. They can. They can. Um, Mother's Day is a little bit late, but you know, Christmas gift. Um, what else is coming in? Anything you want. Yeah, there's my. Mommy, I love you gift. Just, just like random, like mommy, I love you. <laughs> Mother's Day gift. It's our be past Mother's Day. No, be early you. for next Mother's Day. Yes, be early for next Mother's Day or be early for Christmas. Um, seeing as I have to have at least four hundred dollars by like the spring or the fall semester, so like that's gives me two months to raise four hundred dollars on these prints, and only two people will be showing or like three or four people. Unless you have interest in only two people have ordered something. So, yeah, please, <coughs> money, needs. I'm sorry, this is probably a relatively uninteresting episode. We don't really have much to talk about. We've talked about our house. Yeah. Our trailer. Uh, let's see, let's see. My ex roommate left his TV in the dorm, so we're using that as a TV. Mm. Oh, monitor. Right well, yeah. that's, I don't it, exactly it's, it's a know. hybrid between a TV and a computer monitor. It's got HDMI, it's got VGA, but also has a DVD player built in, right? Yeah, it, we're not exactly sure what it is. It's everything! Uh -huh. And. Uh, We're still running on the landlord's power yeah, because well, she hasn't given us give me any registration information for this place. But we're also we need that. we've also been working on decorating. We've got a couple picture, well, a picture, and then Nathan's guitar pick collection. We've got our wolf um, towel, towel, wolf blanket thing hanging on the wall. We've got our FWA poster and another poster hanging up in our bedroom. Yeah, and there's one more poster I want to put up. We're gonna purify this place. We are. We gotta purify this place. I've gotta get furry crap, which is, means I need to go to these cons so I can buy more furry stuff. <laughs> Spend more money on stuff I don't need. Woo! Furry things. We need furry. Things. I don't want those paw-shaped pillows off of Welcome to Rainbow. I know. Those paw-shaped pillows were cute. They were. I wonder where they got them. I don't know. A birthday commission. It's possible. I'm sure you could. I want to. They were cute. Um, I want their disco ball. <laughs> that would be awesome in here at night with, you know, as little as this place is, and an awesome disco ball would just light this place up crazy. Um, yeah, I haven't put up the stereo system yet. Hopefully, we'll get to that at some point. Um, however, I didn't realize that when we were playing loud music in the bedroom earlier, if you crank those things all the way up, you can hear it outside. Yeah. It's a problem. No, but I, when I went out to the computer, uh, or when I went out to the car to get something, I was like, I can faintly hear it. Nice. <laughs> like, if you were just walking by, you probably wouldn't hear it, but if you were right by the house, and you were just like, listening, and you, like, you stopped and went, yeah. I you may not be able to tell what song it was, but anyway. Um, and then if you have extra money during the school year, I might be able to make you your Gale suit. Yes. That'd be awesome. And I hopefully we'll be ready for... Rather than have, use a fur, I mean, I think a fleece would be 
find the word kind of work. I mean, I can look at the material itself. Because I don't. Because I'll look into it too. Yeah, I don't want to have to shave now for the. And I'm not sure you'd want to turn Gale into a fluff dragon. No. I like fluff though. I do like fluff dragons, and I like fluff too. But I don't know. It's up to you. I'll look. Um, you're gonna have to pay for it anyway, so it's up to you. Yeah. Um, if I get good at at making fursuits, eventually I might open up the commissions for them. They'll probably be really cheap. Which means I would not be making anywhere near minimum wage on the meter. Because uh, why fursuits are so expensive is because it takes so much time. So much time to make them. So much time. Because um, just. You would only go to open up for one at a time, probably. Probably. Uh, we use these two as practice. Yeah, definitely. Um, I'll be, I'll have time, or I'll have money this hat this uh, fall so that I can. Oh uh, gosh. Have so we can do MWA. that. Have it time for FWA, and then we can both go sit in there. Yes. The problem with my pursuit is gonna. The hardest part will be doing the wig. First off, I'm gonna make it. I'll do it without a wig, and then I'll work on making the wig. I'll do the wig very well. Because that's going to be the hardest part. I've seen one of a lot how to do it. It was saying to use two weights to put them together to make sure it's enough coverage and stuff. Blah, 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 blah. Um, we'll do that. We'll have lots of fun. Go for it. We are going to FWA, though. I'm going to make sure we are at FWA again next year. Because that was a blast. Yeah. As much as the, the elevators were a pain in the ass. Elevator Con 2013. And I don't know if they're changing locales or not. I'm pretty sure they will now that they realize that those elevators cannot hold 3,000 people. And, and supposedly no one had cell phone reception in there. I had cell phone reception all the time in there. Yeah, I did too. But a lot of people have been like, complained about not having AT&T cell phone people. I had, I had AT&T. That's the thing. I had AT&T. It was late. And I had connection the whole time. I had, I had, I had bars the whole time coming up ceasefire. And hopefully when I get my new cell phone, it will probably be a Galaxy 3. Because they're coming out with the Galaxy 4, so the Galaxy 3 is cheaper and it's still a really good fiber. So. Yeah. Um, the Galaxy 4 has the what like this octa-core processor. It's and, like, ridiculous. It has as much RAM as some of the lower end laptops. I think it's got two gigabytes of RAM. Or yeah, a phone with two gigs of RAM. It's got pretty good processing power too. Yeah, um, 1.9. It, yeah, it's a 1.9 gigahertz octa-core processor. Yeah. What on a phone? On this a is a phone. phone. <laughs> We're talking about that. It's a ridiculous phone. Yeah, my, I mean, my phone has something like 380 megabytes of RAM, so like nothing. <laughs> Comparatively, yeah. Comparatively, and then like, uh, I think mine's like a 1.6. I wonder how fast the Galaxy 4 would be able to load up Skype compared to your phone. Much faster. Much faster, because it's got plenty of memory space for loading messages. Yeah, mine, I had to delete, or I had to set it up so that my phone wouldn't keep messages past like a certain date. And even then it's just terribly slow because the group chat is fast. Too fast for the phone. Man. It, it is so ridiculous. When I'm mobile I have to mute that chat. But yeah, so we got a new place and uh, we're cooking and on our own and we need money so we're selling shit and also um, He's got art commissions going, and I've got this photo thing going. Buy the print, seriously. I've got, I mean, I've got a, I've got a really nice printer, and I've got really nice photo paper, and I've already picked out frames, and I have some really pretty pictures that I'm selling. They're not, you know, it's not, it's not furry art or whatever. It's, you know, well, a well, bunch of there, wildlife. There are art. animals in there. So yeah, there's, there's wildlife. Depends on what you mean by furry. Yeah, it's art. It's still an art form. It's art, and there's furry creatures in it. Yeah. And scary creatures. And not so... And, and just no creatures. I mean, there's really pretty scenic shots. 
I'm a serious man, though. His photos really are good. I, like I can find, I mean, if you want something at a custom size, you can probably find it or build it. You may need to custom order it with me and check it with me. Um, and like I said, if you see something you like, but want it to do something else with it, I don't know. I may be able to do stuff with it. I'm willing to work with you if you, if you have an idea. Um, I'm not going to be able to go out and take a bunch of pictures because I don't have time. But we'll see. Uh, I got a bunch of pictures up. slow releasing these things during the summer we probably won't well if I can get if um if Twitchy comes up we can do a podcast with Twitchy. Yeah. And I'll I'll try to get that done. And then and aside from that we probably won't have that many episodes during the summer. Until fall. Until fall when we get back to school. Yeah. Which is ironic that we should be faster when we get back to school. But we'll also have people we can invite over to do so we'll actually have something to talk about. Yes. Um, and you're still f free to like give us topics and crap so that the more topics we get here this summer, load us up with them so that we can fly through them in the fall. In the fall. Please. We need topics. <laughs> Otherwise, we're just sitting here bantering about uninteresting things. Like, like this episode. Yes. I feel bad because we're going to bore them to tears with this episode when we upload it. Yes. I'm sorry. Um, give us something to talk about, though. I'm serious in there. Because if you've listened to the other ones, you know when we have something we're talking about, we, we can be funny. We can be entertaining. We can <laughs> you know, we can get on a topic and just roll with it. But we need a topic when we're uncreative. So give us your topics. Well, Give us your food and your money. Yes. And your soul. Yeah, maybe not. Maybe not their soul. Oh, fine, you can keep your soul. I don't need it. <laughs> anyway, uh, we'll talk to you at some point during the summer, and I'll upload this at some point this weekend um, if I get the chance. This and weekend it's Sunday, late Sunday. No. Next, well, you know what I mean. During the week, maybe? During the weekend, you're going, oh, he's going home. Next. Yeah. Good pissed. <laughs> anyway. By this weekend, we'll I mean next weekend. We can. Yeah. You're a confusing person. You're going home, so. <laughs> Sad face. Sad face. Uh, yeah, I'm going back to visit my parents. Hopefully, I can convince my mom to give me some money to buy new clothes. Because most of the clothes I have was from when I was in the some of this from my school too. But yeah. But hopefully your dad doesn't force you to get your cut. He won't. I won't let him. He'll be like, I'm not living with him. He's not paying for my food or anything. He's paying for the car and that's it. Yeah, we that, are the phone use that. that's dying and I'm about to your replace place. it. Yeah, we're we're fed up with this car right now. We'll talk to you later. Give us, give us ideas and stuff to talk about, please. Yes, please.